In this video, we will cover the VCOM WebRTC control panel. The VCOM WebRTC control panel serves as a virtual key panel, enabling users to speak across various platforms, including iOS, Android, Windows, and Mac. Shown here is our Windows app. To begin, you will need to enter the domain name or IP address of your VCOM virtual matrix. Use the login credentials provided by your administrator. Here, I will use one of the default logins that come pre-configured. The control panel features a grid of selectors representing users, groups, devices, or video streams. Shown here is the default configuration. Administrators can configure each control panel individually, providing a different set of selectors for each user. Voice activity is indicated by a flashing white border. This means that the selector, in this case a party line, has audio that can be listened to. When a user logs in, their selector will be displayed. To talk to them, press their talk key. Hello, can you hear me? Hello, yes, I can hear you. Live video streams can be added using the system administration. Click the play button to watch the video. Additionally, if your system is configured with a SIP phone line, you can initiate a call by clicking on the phone icon and dialing the desired number. This concludes our VCOM WebRTC control panel tutorial. Please watch our other videos to learn more about VCOM.